Welcome back to your news at 10. The Nueces County Junior Livestock Show is the largest in the state of Texas. The two week event wrapped up today with some participants taking home thousands of dollars in prize money. Our Catherine McGinney has more from some of the top earners. Over $27,000. 27, $27, That's what a grand champion steer sold for Saturday at the Nueces County Livestock Show. Many of the students, like 12 year old Kirsten, get started early on. I'm very proud. It's just uh, it's crazy this feeling that to win the, uh, the show for steers. For 85 years now, the Nueces County Junior Livestock Show has been supporting and educating the youth of Nueces County. All of the proceeds that the, the child gets at the sale, they usually put toward furthering their education. And then Nueces County Junior Livestock Show also has a scholarship committee. In eight and a half decades, the Junior Livestock Show has raised $1.9 million for scholarships. But for Kirsten and other students, raising champion animals doesn't come easy. Oh, a lot. You have to spend a lot of time with them, a couple hours at least a day, and have to work with them every single day. Along with homework and extracurricular activities, students are challenged with raising an animal. Making sure it's fed, making sure it has appropriate medical care, walking, exercising. It's, it's amazing. It's, it's really seeing all your hard work pay off. And uh, we know when you're working all these times, all this time over the co past couple of months, it's, uh, it's good to see it all pay off. Grady won $11,000, which will go towards getting a degree in agriculture. I want to go to Texas Tech University and uh, pursue a degree in ag business. But it's about more than just agriculture. Students are learning about entrepreneurship, responsibility, and communication. Skills that can be taken beyond the barn. Everything that these kids do, they are so accomplished, so well-spoken, and they're going to be our leaders for tomorrow. Catherine McGinty, Chris 6 News.